loosen our oil cap, remove this. Let's go ahead and pop off our engine cover here. Reinstall our oil fill cap. And set the cover aside. I'm gonna use our ratchet on the front of the tensioner. I'm gonna push that forward. It's gonna release the tension on that belt. Release our serpentine belt and then release the tensioner. Now go ahead and remove the belt. From all your accessories here. If you want to, you can take a picture of the front of the motor uh, so you remember the belt routing. This has nine pulleys on here. can be confusing when you go to reassemble. Take a picture. You can do a drawing. It's best to document the route so you don't take a 10-minute job and turn it into a two-hour job. Go ahead and install our belt. This is the point where your picture that you may have taken earlier will come in handy or your drawing. Now that we have the belt run around almost all of our pulleys, we have it off of our idler pulley right here. We're going to bring up the tensioner and then we're going to pull this belt and put it underneath this idler pulley here.
Now that we have the belt on, you want to go around to each pulley, make sure the belt is in all of the grooves properly. Power steering, idler, alternator, tensioner, idler, water pump, crankshaft, AC, and idler. Everything looks good. Fill here. 